Good afternoon, it's just another collector. Uh, today's uh, Thursday, uh, the 9th of April, and I'm sharing this really interesting issue, or I should say series, or only issue, because they didn't, they didn't make any more after this. This is The Punisher Meets Archie. I did get this today, actually, in the mail from eBay. Um, so, so Marvel Comics and Archie Comics, uh, came together and to bring their characters together in a story. So, of course, it was the Punisher and it was, of course, Archie and the Riverdale gang. This came out in August, uh, 1994. Uh, I actually remember... What the first time I ever got this, it was July 1994, and uh, and I remember I remember getting it at the 7-Eleven, and I just thought it was, I you know something that you would never think you would ever see. And anyway, I lost it like probably a few months after I had it, over 25 years ago. Then I think I got this again at a comic show maybe 10 years ago, and then that I I think I sold. So now I have it back the third time. I'm not going to let it go. So it's got a nice cover. It's one of those like, uh, I forget what they call it. Uh, so here's Victor Goral, like the editor of Archie Comics. He just passed away uh, in February. And the other editor, Tom... Uh, Falco, I believe, right? From, from Marvel. And they came up with this, and it was it was an interesting story. So let's see. It's, uh, that's the writer. The artist. And there's the credits. So it has 48 pages. No ads, which is cool. So it's got, yeah, it's got that in the back. That's interesting. got this really nice uh, picture there. This also by Stan Goldberg, one of the artists from Archie Comics. This cover was used for the uh, new Stan edition. This particular uh, picture. This one, of course, is the... I forget what they call it. You know, the more expensive edition. Yeah, I remember reading this, like, the whole summer in 1994. I was, like, reading it every day. I thought it was just really something. So there's this guy that the Punisher's going after. He looks kind of like Archie. I'm trying to get a good picture of him. Uh, yeah, there he is. And I think they mistake him for Archie in Riverdale. Yeah, there's the real Archie. So you have like a few pages of Marvel. You have the Punisher. And then you'll have like a next, another uh, two pages, you'll have the Archie, the Archie gang. So again, yeah, I thought it was a good story. If you guys never heard of it or read this, definitely take a look. <sighs> yeah, sadly, they never, uh, they never went on anymore. They didn't, I don't think they did anything after this. I think it was just the only issue, and that was it. I'm not sure what happened, why it fell through, but I guess they, I don't know, if maybe they didn't sell, or I don't know what happened. So here's a spoiler. I'm showing the end of it. So, you know, I wouldn't look if you haven't read it. So that's, that was the last panel. So there's Jughead. Uh, I mean, another guy that looks like Jughead. And then, of course, there's the Wolverine Claw. So hinting that the next issue would have been Wolverine. But unfortunately, they never, they didn't go through with it. So, so that's it for now. I have some other stuff I'm going to be showing uh, tomorrow and over the weekend. I have some things, again, coming in the mail. 
Thanks again for watching. Hope everyone's doing well. We're going to be home quarantined for a really long time. Uh, the schools are, they just announced today, schools will be closed to the end of the school year. So we're uh, doing everything online, basically, as far as teaching and doing work. So uh, that's how it is. Stay well, keep washing your hands, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.